I'm just trying to speak like a different language aside from Zulu because no one here is Zulu, bro. It's actually so mad. Like so far, I've met Andy Bailey, I've met Otosa. checklist and getting like a few groceries for me i don't know my mom went. i'm actually looking i made a grocery list and stuff i might just put it up because i feel like it's the things that i'll be able to like use and stuff oh okay um so i don't know Um, we just left Sekos just now. My gun is just downstairs with the uh, thingy. In the middle of the trolley. So we're just going up to buy like um, plastic containers if possible because apparently there's like some cute little like plastic shoppy type vibe here. We're not too sure. But yeah. Goodbye to the old me. It's already gone. Do -do -do -do. And I can't wait, 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 wait to get you home. Just a mission, no. When is Buga safe this morning? Lapa. Oh, glass mics. No, 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 no. Ya bomb champa mofuno bega kia za kola. Mrs. Obega pezo a coffee table. game i'm here to get an umbrella and headphones um because i'm getting a roomie so i can't like play my speaker anymore <laughs> Go Let me take this off. Should I? I don't know. So what's good in the hood? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Um, for those that do not know me and are seeing me for the first time, my name is Wenzo Gutlin, but I got here for short because it was a good to have you with me here today, baby. So, um, guys, I'm in a new place. I know you can tell. You know, things are looking a bit different. Things are looking a little like, ooh, you know. But I... I'm in university. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a I'm a I'm a uni girlie, you know. 
Uh, so I am in UFS, University of Free State, for those that don't know what that UFS means. I'm uh, super excited, but I think like so far my experience here is very interesting because obviously like I'm from KZN, right? So when I'm Zulu, like I speak Zulu, whatever. Here, baby, there's none of that. <laughs> There's literally none of that. Um, people here are either Sutu, it's a few Swanas. Like yesterday, when I was registering with my mom on campus, um, I met a girl that was Debele. Also, there's another Kosa girl. Kosa, I'm cool with, you know. Shout out to Michele, shout out. So, you know, I can understand a bit, you know. And what to Keta, but, you know, I can... It's similar to Zulu also, so it's cool. But the rest, I can see uh, you know, like I can say like oh do me like you know okay get thing ends there <laughs> literally ends there, you know, or I can say keep at a things like that's where it ends, guys. Like it's literally you know, so learning a new language very soon, you know. Yeah, anyways, um so I did not think that I was gonna be making a video like this but i may as well because like i've low-key just been rotting here for like the past couple of hours i woke up from a nap by the way so because after my mom and granny left i was just like oh i just need to chill eat wind down and then maybe take a nap just it was a power nap to get myself going again so that's exactly what happened i'm also really shocked about the fact that like it's still like light outside because it's only like 20 past six ish like pm so i'm just like oh so the sun probably set at seven you know eight it's given cape town <laughs> it's really given cape town but um yeah i'm just gonna be unpacking now um orientation has already started it started last week but i only got accepted last week so it was never gonna be me i was never gonna be that girl i was never going to be early so i don't know when it's gonna finish hopefully it finishes like next week so i can actually like have some orient be orientated you know but it's cool though because i think maybe the main orientation can finish but like my own faculties one probably and guys guys as in let me actually not say too much but uh i texted some girl and she was just like oh you know i'll send you the program whatever i was like you are a star <laughs> you are phenomenal you are phenomenal love you loads Kesana. so um yeah right now i'm gonna be unpacking so i need to actually open the blinds outside as well also this room is not dark but i definitely need to be in the lights for y'all to see me proper um it's not dark in general but it's dark on cam if that makes sense but let's unpack i did not think i was going to be doing an unpack with me and let me tell you why i just did not think i was going to do it i don't have a proper reason like i just didn't envision it for myself you know because i thought like because move ins with like I know it's gonna sound bad, but like movements with my family just tend to be very chaotic. <laughs> yeah, but it's, it's, not, it's not that cute, you know? So, yeah, because sometimes it's filled with constant. Oh man, So I'm just like, child, mm -mm, we, we ain't gonna have none of that on the internet. But um, I'm packing by myself, so I guess like it's cool and stuff. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's it, y'all. I'm a university. So this is the current situation. I just put like all the clothes out and then just spread it out on the bed. So this is the um, wardrobe space and stuff. Yeah. I'll be honest. Um, I don't know how I'm going to do this because like you guys, I'm sure you guys remember like my, uh, my wardrobe from boarding was literally like twice the size and I still had like space to get me. Now I'm working with the, a bikini space, which is fine and stuff, but like, Ooh, <laughs> I'm gonna go for my stuff, but it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. I'll make a plan. I think um I'm just gonna roll the clothes and like put them in rolls, and then if I ever need to wear something, I can just like where can I get an iron? 
can iron it and stuff um but yeah yeah i think i'm just gonna roll it i'm sorry i'm just thinking because i'm just like okay you know rolling was that gonna work i don't know i don't know but let's find out <laughs> actually worked oh So I kind of got distracted but luckily for me like I don't have that many things because the most important thing was just to get my clothes inside there because I didn't want to like be having to fiddle in my suitcase in the morning and stuff so um yeah I don't know what else I'm gonna need to do because I'm kind of like done because I packed my food and stuff like yesterday so I don't need to like do any of that um but I do need to cook and make myself some food because I gotta eat 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 also i won't lie like whether you're living in like a self-catering res or some student accommodation or basically a place that is not gonna cook for you hmm i don't know how i feel about it <laughs> I don't know how i feel about it because i was even saying to aka i was just like friend we literally went from being served meals at boarding to literally having to cook for ourselves now and also the thing of like um because i was when mikla was um when we texted mikla today she was literally just like bro she doesn't understand how our mothers were able to do this for our entire childhood like literally coming back from work cooking a whole meals like bro like a proper like meal prep oh mm, mm. makes you just have a newfound respect for them but i don't know what i'm gonna make today but i'm not gonna make anything like big or sexy i'm probably just gonna i don't know I feel, i'm feeling mm, i don't know because almost like 10 o'clock now and i want to sleep before half past 10 and i need to get this stuff like done even if i don't finish everything today but like it's fine though um yeah what else do i need to do um not that much really because i can just yeah, i don't know for when I wake up and see you with me, no one can hurt you. If I could change the way that you see yourself. I don't know about y'all, but personally, I'm about to go to bed, but I'm definitely, I'm going to shower and then we'll probably read my Bible. Um, I don't know what time I'm going to wake up tomorrow. Because I don't know what time we have to be on campus because um, I asked the girl that sent me the program when I should be there, if I should go or something like that. And if I do go, where do I go? So I'm just waiting for her to respond to that. She's probably going to respond in the morning because it is very like, it's actually not late. It's just almost 11, but it's late for me, for someone who usually sleeps at like before half past 11-ish. So um, yeah, I guess I'll see you guys the next time I need to do something.